Good morning and welcome to the Mike Show for Wednesday, August 30, 2023. 51 degrees at 7.18 a.m. and I am your host, Fah Kamal, and I'm a tired sinner. I'm here with Brother Prince and Co-Star Michael, Brother Prince and Co-Star Samuel, it's another overcast, cold, and windy morning, considering the time of the year. Quite windy already. And we didn't get much of an August. We didn't get much of a summer. And we've got, what, a roughly, I don't know. I don't know when the official first day of fall is, but it felt like it got here already. Seems like it. Feels like it. Anyway. We're running out of room on this phone to record videos. Haven't deleted any in a while, so... We only had like five and a half minutes left of space to record, so this is going to be a short and sweet one. Maybe we'll do a part two. Maxie's joined us. He's having a little breakfast. Sully's outside the door crying. He was up here on the sill, but wouldn't come in through the window. And I don't want to get up and let him out because Mikey and Max are, or Mikey and Sam are here, and they're nice and comfy. And if he didn't want to come through the window, well, that's tough rocks for him. So what do you think of that? Welcome back, and I don't really mean that. And I didn't mean it when I said good morning. I'm going to do a quick recap from yesterday. Um we got to jam a lot in here. We're running out of time. It's Sushi Wednesday at Meyer. Uh, yesterday we had hoped to go for a bike ride, but it ended up drenching, downpouring rain. We made it to the gun shop to give a report on the maintenance that Jeff did to my Security 9 and how it performed when I went shooting the other day. I uh, went to Meyer came home, I cooked some chicken thighs, I made chicken salad, um, I scored some corn on the cob, so I made corn on the cob for dinner last night. There's Bobby jumping up again. Come on, Sully, come on over here. Come on, Sullivan. <coughs> oh, but I had actually been literally seconds away from dozing off into a nap I've been threatening to take for like 40 years. <coughs> Literally seconds, just about ready to drop off into deep sleep. <coughs> and we were gifted with a, a short rehearsal by Mick Shrimpton, the drummer for Spinal Tap, who lives next door, one of Alpina's loudest bands. I spent the afternoon just laying out here, hanging with the cats trying to fall asleep, but it never happened. Come on, Sullivan. Come on in. Don't be a ball breaker. Just come on in. You can do it. I will help you. Come on. Come on. Come on, Sully. Oh, boy. I'm going to take a break again. So anyway, Sully's in. Elsie's in somewhere, too. We read to the loves. I don't remember what movie we watched. I never do. My brain is soft. It just gets that way. Who knows what it's going to be like a year from now. Hey, will I even know my name? <laughs> oh, boy. But it was nice to take a break from cycling and everything. I wanted to, and there was a window when I could have went out on my fat bike. I did oil up the chain and got it ready for, excuse me, a ride. But um, anyway, it just rained, and I missed the window of opportunity. And with that, I think we are going to cut this one short because we are literally running out of space for this video. It's probably just going to shut off if I don't stop pretty soon. So we're going to close this out and do a part two. But if not, 
piss off and thanks for not tuning in.